The misconceptions about people in prison is that prison basically is warehousing and that these people, they serve no purpose. That's a barrier to overcome. These are people that have been abandoned in life, relationships and socially so much has been fragmented. They don't know how to interact with people. And trust is a thing that they don't know a lot of that. We're about rebuilding lives, restoration, reconciliation, reconciliation to God, the person himself. Yes, they're in there, they're incarcerated, they're inmates, but we're trying to be Jesus to them. If you focus on their crimes, you won't be able to minister to them. But if you focus on their worth and they're redeemable, and you begin to, to approach them that way, then you don't, you don't look at the crime, you look at the depth of the person. For these men, it is the good news. It's liberating for them. They've committed crimes, heinous crimes, some of them, and now here's this opportunity to have hope instead of hurt. When you show the love of Christ to them and they begin to see that, then they become curious. And that's where we begin to see the breakthroughs. Quite a few of them are going to be back out in the community. We somehow need to recognize that they do have purpose because they're going to be mainstream back in. Do we want them to continue on the same track they've been in? Or do we hope that they'll have a future that's different than what they've known as far as their past? And then part of us as Jubilee is our aftercare programs and things of like that. Then we can say this is what's available through our own ministries outside the prison walls. And I can say that I've known men who have been successful. Not all have, but that's the way life is. But some are now preachers, they have a family, they're contributing to the very community they used to take away from. From my own personal viewpoint of what I've learned being a prison chaplain and being part of Jubilee, people are redeemable and there is hope for them. Then we see a change that validates what Christ talked about all along. I've come to set the captives free.